Keep it real. They kids friend. Yeah. Who yeah. the fuck can believe that that shit is real by any means with all of that? Make my friend group. I'm the only polyamorous person and I have the least sex. These days, Jada Pinkett Smith gets to work with her daughter Willow Smith and her mother, Adrian Banfield Norris, thanks to their Facebook Watch series Red Table Talk. But that wasn't always the case, and Pinkett Smith admits when her kids were younger, finding the balance between work and motherhood was challenging. It was during that time that one of the most controversial moments in the Smith's family happened. 13-year-old Willow was photographed in bed with a 20-year-old man, something that exposed Jada as the bad mother that she is. So, who was this man? How did he end up in bed with underage Willow? And was Jada aware? We got the answers to all this and much more. Let's get it on. In early 2016, Jada Pinkett Smith played a comically villainous role in the movie Bad Moms, in which her character, Stacy, shamed other mothers over their parenting skills. Stacy is a perfectionist who believes Mila Cooney's character, Amy, is a terrible person for having a career that occasionally causes her kids to be late. But in reality, Jada is the worst mother, at least going by how she has guided her two children, Jaden and Willow. It all dates back to a photo that was taken back in 2014. It's black and white, a little dark, and a he let wrong. At least that's what people online are saying about a photo of the 13-year-old Willow Smith, daughter of famous parents Will Smith and Jada Pinkett Smith, and actor Moises Arias. The photo in question depicts Willow and Arias, the then 20-year-old actor best known for his portrayal of Rico on Disney's Hannah Montana TV show. On a bed, Arias is shirtless, leaning up against a wall on a corner of the bed, while Willow lies, fully clothed, next to him. The two are not touching or even looking at one another. But when it first popped up on social media back around May 7, 2014, the reaction was swift and negative, triggering a flood of headlines like one from the gloss that declares, this creepy picture will seriously gross you out and prompting the images to be pulled from Instagram, the Los Angeles Times notes. The indecent shop exposed Jada and she had no one to save her when netizens decided to descend on her fully armored with words. They said the celebrated screen star okayed her daughter sexually being exploited by older men. The picture and the comments even caught the attention of the Ella Department of Children and Family Services, having reportedly launched an investigation against Will and Jada. According to Radar Online, the two were unhappy that their parenting had been called into question. Many agreed with the actions taken by CPS, calling the photo inappropriate. Some said Will and Jada needed to step up as parents, and one Us Weekly reader went so far as to say, I see both the Smith kids in rehab in a year or two at Willow pregnant. Then the told you so can begin. It may not help that the Celeb Smiths have been well reported in the media for their open, punishment-free parenting style. There have even been reports that the controversial pic was taken at the Coachella Valley Music and Arts Festival, which Willow and Jaden may have been allowed to attend unsupervised. The family, however, stood behind Willow and Arias. Will Smith and Jada Pinkett Smith believe their daughter is very mature enough so to make her own decisions as long as they clearly don't cross the line. Sources connected to the Smith family told TMZ, the Smiths have known Arias for years. He's also reportedly best friends with Jaden. Mom and dad view the photo as innocent fun and an expression of art, TMZ added at the time. Jada even chastised the paparazzi, according to Us Weekly, saying, there was nothing sexual about that picture or that situation. You guys are projecting your trash onto it. You're acting like covert pedophiles, and that's not cool. But whether or not the photo was out of bounds is a matter of opinion. But some stood with the Smiths and questioned the actions of CPS. Really? That is what children's services are concerned about. A Huffington Post reader writes, I saw the picture and saw nothing wrong with it. How many children are abused or killed in the Los Angeles area every year? Can they not find important issues to spend their time on? According to Willow, there was nothing more than a healthy friendship between her and Arias. The friendship between the two has been a long one, and older brother Jan and Smith is the link between the two, with Moises and Jaden being close friends since they were teenagers. In 2014, Jaden's friendship group comprised much of Hollywood's young elite, including Kendall and Kylie Jenner, Justin Bieber, and Moises. A source told US Weekly, Moises calls Jaden his best friend. They are very, very close, and he's been hanging with Justin Bieber through Jaden after that. When reflecting on the friendship between her daughter and Moises, Jada Pinkett Smith said in an episode of Red Table Talk, the boy basically lived with us, before adding that Moises and his brother Mateo were like Willow's brothers and were always in this house with their shirts off. Will and Jada have been seen by millions as failed parents. 
This is hard to dispute, considering all the family drama they have gone through with endless rumors of open relationships, bisexuality, cheating, Tupac, entanglements, and whatnots. On his part, Jaden Smith has always had a difficult time with Jada Pinkett Smith's desire to share all of the nuances of the family's drama with the world. Jaden knows that his family is a little different and how open his mother is about their personal life that has never been easy for him, a source revealed to us. The Red Table Talk host has never shied away from airing out the family's dirty laundry, particularly on her Facebook Watch series. In a July 2020 episode of the show, she famously admitted to having an entanglement with singer August Dalston a mid-time apart from her husband, Will Smith, to whom she has been married since 1997. The pair share Jaden and daughter Willow, 21. The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air alum, 53, also has an older son, Trey, 29, from his first marriage to Sherry Zampino. We were over, the Scream 2 star told her husband about her relationship with Alcina on the show. From there, as time went on, I got into a different kind of entanglement with August. Will, who appeared on the show to address the rumors about their marriage, concurred, adding, we decided we were going to separate for a period of time, and you go figure out how to make yourself happy, and I'll figure out how to make myself happy. Despite the discomfort the Californian native has endured thanks to his parents' candidness, at this point, he is used to having his personal life on display and criticized at times. For his part, Jaden had brought himself to the table before and even discussed his use of psychedelic drugs with his mom. He and the sister just want to move past the Oscar slap, the source explains of the moment at the 2022 Academy Awards when Will smacked Chris Rock across the face after the comedian made fun of Pinkett Smith's shaved head. The Gotham Allen has been open about her hair loss due to alopecia. Jaden doesn't seem phased at all anymore by his father's outbursts, the insider continues. It was, of course, a shock in the beginning, but his father has always been the family's rock, and Jaden knows he was only protecting his mom. Aside from his sister being hooked to older men, Jaden himself had had a fair share of disagreements with his parents and even wanted out when he was barely 15 years old. Following the meltdown from the film After Earth, things unraveled between Will Smith and his son Jaden behind the scenes. In 2013, Will teamed up with his son for the big budget film After Earth. Unfortunately, it didn't do well. Critics were also harsh on Jaden's performance. After Earth was an abysmal box office and critical failure, the senior Smith admitted in his memoir, Will. And what was worse was that Jaden took the hit. Fans and the press were absolutely vicious, they said and printed things about Jaden that I refused to repeat. Jaden had faithfully done everything that I'd instructed him to do, and I had coached him into the worst public mauling he'd ever experienced. He added that his son had lost faith in his leadership as a father. It's why Jaden asked for emancipation. We never discussed it, but I know he felt betrayed, he felt misled, and he lost his trust in my leadership. The Men in Black star continued. At 15 years old, when Jaden asked about being an emancipated minor, my heart shattered. He ultimately decided against it, but it sucks to feel like you've hurt your kids. Fans also feel like that $130 million flop was the reason Jaden stopped acting and made the switch to music. After all, his father himself sees After Earth as a bad decision on his part. That was a valuable lesson for me a few years ago with After Earth, Will told Variety in 2015. That was the most painful failure in my career. My son was involved in After Earth, and I led him into it. That was excruciating, and talking of blunders, Will also made the same with Willow. Back in 2010, Will and Jada's daughter Willow rose to fame for her hit song With My Hair. She was only 10 years old. His success of the track scored her a month-long tour, opening for Justin Bieber. However, she wasn't so thrilled about finishing it. On the last night of her European tour, she told her dad she wanted to quit, but Will pushed her to do her upcoming Australian tour. Willow resisted by shaving her head, and it actually worked. Willow came skipping into the kitchen for breakfast. Good morning, Daddy, Willow said joyfully as she bounced to the refrigerator Will recalled in his memoir. My jaw nearly dislocated, dislodged, and shattered on the kitchen floor. My world dominating, hair whipping, a future global superstar was totally bald. During the night, Willow had shaved her entire head. Instead of getting upset, it made the father of three realize that he should have listened to Willow. My mind raced and scrambled. How was she going to whip her hair if she didn't have any? Who the hell wants to pay to watch some kid whip their head back and forth, he continued. But before I could respond, I felt something slowly turning, shifting, until it clicked into place. In a moment of divine connection and revelation, she had reached me. I leaned down, peered deeply into her eyes, and said, I got it. I am so sorry. I see you. And there you have it, Will and Jada making some seriously terrible mistakes with their kids while still young. Do you think that they have been bad parents? Let us know in the comments section below. And that's it from us today. Until next time, bye!